Hello YouTube viewers, hope you're all doing good. Welcome to this video. I am Venkat and this is Just Me an Open Source Channel. Right, in this video, um, I'm going to show you how to enable billing alerts. So since we are using AWS free tier, it's always a good idea to enable um, billing alerts. So um, in all my videos, I'm going to be using resources that are free tier eligible, but in some cases uh, where it's not possible, I might use uh, some resources that requires that um, charges cost that, 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 that involves cost right so to keep everything under control I'm going to create a billing alert so whenever uh, it exceeds a certain threshold certain amount set uh, per month it's going to send me an email alert so that's what we're going to see in this video okay so to do that go to the billing dashboard uh, remember you have to log in uh, with your root account not with the uh, any user account that you've created even that user even though that user is an admin user you won't be able to see the billing dashboard so make sure to log in using your root account go to my billing dashboard and then go to billing preferences and by the way if you go to home so this is where you see uh, the history and trend um, if you only can change your billing currency to do that go to uh, the my account and there you will be able to change your billing currency so for creating alerts go to billing preferences and then receive PDF invoice by email I don't want that option uh, receive free tier usage alert so whenever you are approaching the free tier limit or you have exceeded your free tier limit you will get notified by email if you select this option so that looks interesting so let's select that option so that will send uh, alerts to your registered email ID, which is your root account's email ID. But if you want that to be sent to any custom email address, you can add that in this field. So uh, receive billing alerts. So whenever you are ex whenever you exceeded your uh, billing alert billing threshold, uh, you will receive an email. So let's select this option. So to do that, we also need to create a billing alert. So billing alert is done using CloudWatch, which is a cloud monitoring service. You can either click this link or you can directly go to the CloudWatch service. So we'll go there, search for CloudWatch, click CloudWatch, and from here go to billing. Okay, so uh, bear in mind if you are in a different region or uh, in a particular region, it might not be available in all the region, but you will get uh, a notification saying requesting you to go to switch to a different region that has billing enabled. So create alarm. You get 10 free alarms or 1000 free email notifications each month as part of your AWS free tier. Okay, let's go ahead and create an alarm. Uh, namespace billing metric name is okay currency I'm going to change that to GBP maximum six hour period that's okay threshold type is static whenever estimated charge is greater than five pounds say for example uh, I won't be using five pounds a month because all my videos uh, I'll be using free tier or if at all possible otherwise um, at the end of the video I'll just clean up all the resources but this is just in case uh, if we exceed five pounds a month it's just to go just good to know good to set this limit and you can go to your console and see any idle resources that you're not using you can just delete that resource uh, just to stop avoiding uh, incurring charges okay so click next in alarm select an existing SNS topic so Amazon is going to send you an email through their simple notification service which works by topic so you create a topic and you create uh, endpoints so whenever you publish message to that topic that topic will uh, push the messages to all the recipients whether it's uh, by SMS or through emails okay so this is a brand new free tier account we don't have any SNS topic so let's create a new topic create a new topic let's change the name to my billing or just billing alerts okay endpoint that will receive the notification so I'm gonna enter my email address venkaten at gmail.com 
Uh, you can add multiple address. This is comma separated. If you want, you can add multiple email addresses. Create topic. Okay, that topic is created. View in SNS console. Let's go to the SNS console. So that's the simple notification servers. If I look at the topics, so there is one topic. Let's go to topics. So there is one topic which we just created, billing alerts. And there is the spending confirmation, venkaten at gmail.com. So once you create a topic and add an endpoint, uh, you will get an email about the subscription so you have to basically click that link in your email to subscribe to this topic. So once you subscribe, you will start receiving uh, messages whenever some AWS resource posts to this topic. Okay, let me close that. Um, add notification. If you want another notification, you can add other notifications. Let's go ahead and click next. Add a description for this resource. Alarm name billing alert alarm description alert me whenever my usage goes above five pounds through email okay click next that's good so that's the red line so that's our threshold so whenever our usage goes above five dollars or sorry five pounds a month we will get the notification create alarm Okay, the alarm is created at the moment. It's in insufficient state because we don't have any costs. Um, that's why it's an insufficient state. Pending confirmation. So uh, if I go to my email now, uh, I would have received an email and we need to click the subscription link that will subscribe you to the topic that we created. And once we subscribe to the topic and if we cross this billing threshold that we set, which is five pounds, uh, CloudWatch is going to push a message to that uh, topic. So that topic will push uh, the message to all the recipients. So at the moment, there is one recipient, which is one email address subscribed to that topic. Okay, cool. So that's it I wanted to show you in this video. It's always good to uh, uh, create this billing alert because you never know uh, what is going to cost you which resources is going to cost you it's better to it's safer side to be it's it's better to be on the safer side uh, to create billing alerts all right hope you enjoyed this video please let me know uh, if you've got any questions on this one and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends if you like this video I will see you all in my next video bye bye